बैलेंस ऑफ केमिकल इक्वेशन बाय लॉ ऑफ कंसर्वेशन ऑफ मास पोटेशियम परमैंगनेट प्लस हाइड्रोजन सल्फाइड प्लस सल्फ्यूरिक एसिड इज गिव्स अस सल्फर प्लस मैंगनीज सल्फेट प्लस पोटेशियम सल्फेट प्लस वाटर इन दिस इक्वेशन द रिएक्टेंट्स आर पोटेशियम परमैंगनेट हाइड्रोजन सल्फाइड एंड सल्फ्यूरिक एसिड and the products are sulfur manganese sulfate potassium sulfate and water in the reactants side there are one potassium atom one manganese atom eight oxygen atoms four hydrogen atoms and two sulfur atoms present and the products side there are two potassium atoms one manganese atom nine oxygen atoms two hydrogen atoms and three sulfur atoms present the number of atoms are not balanced on both sides To balance the chemical equation, we need to make use of coefficients. A coefficient is a number that we place in front of a chemical formula. In this equation, we need to balance the potassium atoms first. To do this, we need to put a coefficient of two in front of KMnO4. The potassium atoms are balanced. Now we need to balance the manganese atoms. To do this. We need to put a coefficient of 2 in front of MnSO4. The manganese atoms are balanced. Now we need to balance the sulfur atoms. To do this, we need to put a coefficient of 3 in front of H2SO4. The sulfur atoms are balanced. Now we need to balance the oxygen atoms. To do this, we need to put a coefficient of 8 in front of h2o the oxygen atoms are balanced now we need to balance the hydrogen atoms to do this we need to put a coefficient of 5 in front of h2s the hydrogen atoms are balanced but the sulfur atoms are unbalanced to balance that We need to put a coefficient of 5 in front of s. Yes. The equation is now balanced. There are two potassium atoms, two manganese atoms, 20 oxygen atoms, 16 hydrogen atoms and 8 sulfur atoms on both sides. If you like this video please subscribe my channel and press on the bell icon